Yeah, I've never been into images for their own sake, you know. I, I've never, you know, I like sitting looking at a sunset, but I wouldn't be interested in photographing it for its own sake, if you, you know what I mean? I, I, so um, I, I, I started off, I suppose, painting and then in stills photography and gradually into documentaries, but it was always about subject and it wasn't really image making for its own, sen own sake. So I think storytelling really came for me actually, in, probably with documentaries more than, you know, stills. I mean, you do still photography, you take a subject and you try and tell a story through individual images, but um, it's not quite the same as a moving image, obviously. Um, but the documentaries I kind of worked on were much more, um, they weren't structured, they weren't scripted, so we would be basically ma making a film as we went along. We would take a subject and go there and spend, you know, months or whatever dealing with a particular subject, and uh, then the story would evolve out of the time we spent there and our relationship to the subject, if you like, you know. I mean, I did a film about around the world yacht race once, and I, I, you know, I, I sailed on the yacht, and it wasn't, again, it wasn't about sunsets and waves breaking and, and icebergs. I mean, there were plenty of that, but it was really about the relationship between the people on the, on the yacht and how the time and the physical circumstances, you know, how it changed their relationship, you know. What it felt like, not what it just looked like.